with Kathy's Community Spotlight, and I'm here with Jordan and Miss Norma, and Jordan is with the Florence uh, Chamber, and we're just going to kind of highlight one of our local businesses that's located on Highway 49 South uh, between Donna's and the flea market here. It's called Southern Collective. So, Miss Norma, tell us a little bit about your business, what you do, when you got started. Well, um, I actually started in a booth in a, a, a town in Mendenhall a few years ago, and I loved it so much. It just kind of, I loved interacting with the customers, and it just kind of gave me the desire to do this on my own, which I didn't know was possible, but God made a way, and I was presented with this opportunity to take this location. So I took it, and March will be here two years. So <laughs> um, it's been an adventure, but my my heart is with people that um make things you know handmade um, products so most everything we have is handmade with the exception of some new boutique items so we do have mostly uh handmade stuff we have handmade jewelry quilts uh totes pottery candles <laughs> all kinds of crafts a lot a lot of home decor and stuff so I just love my vendors and I love giving them the opportunity to have a space to uh, sell their products so that they can't, not everybody can go out and open up a store. So it gives them an opportunity to come in and have a small space to sell their products and to, and I love to show them off. <laughs> I love to brag on them. I get so excited when they bring in new items. So it's, um, I just love it. Um, it is just a lot of fun for me and I love to be able to help others. So this is a great way to do that and to, kind of create a community and um, to be able to support local artists. That, that sounds great. Supporting the local artists and small businesses is what is what we want to do. It's what we want to do throughout this holiday season and in the upcoming year. So Jordan, kind of explain to us what is a vendor market? Can you tell us what that is? So a vendor market is a store comprised of numerous uh, vendors. Like she said, handmade items, uh, boutiques. So if you make or sell something online or in store, you could come open up a small little space and then you don't have to cover the overhead like you own your own store. Norma here would um, cover the taxes, cover the employees. She does live videos for you and then she handles all of the sales. So you don't have to actually be here to sell your products. You just bring it in, rent out a, rent out a little space and she handles the rest for you. Thank you, that was very informative because I know there's some people that don't really understand what a vendor market is. And this way, I know there's a lot of crafty people and I know several people that are very talented and um, they try to sell it from home or off of the internet and mm -hmm. they get discouraged because they don't get the exposure that they want to get. So that's fabulous. So Ms. Nora, how long, you said you've been here two years and, and you're located, you know, right past Donna. So, mm -hmm. you know, when people are coming to Donna's to get fruit or mm -hmm. anything, they can just scoot on down here. Um, but you're right before the flea market. Yes. So it's a, it's a little bit, we're going to give you a shot of that on the outside so you can see what it looks like. There's a big sign out front that says Southern Collective. Uh, so Ms. Norma, do you have any booth space available right I now? I do, I do. I would love to have some more vendors. Um, I'm looking actually for some boutique vendors that sell ladies clothes or children's clothes. Um, but I do have space available and I would love to have some new vendors added. This is a great time to jump in here before the holiday season. It, it's your best time of year <laughs> to sell your stuff because everybody's shopping for their uh, Christmas gifts. I have a lot of people that have just already bought everything for their Christmas in here. So and I appreciate that so much. And it's just, we consider ourselves a local gift shop um, because we have a little bit of something for everyone. And it's unique stuff that you definitely cannot find in the big box stores for sure. Okay. All right. Well, so if anybody has any questions, they can contact Miss Norma down here at Southern Collective. Um, Ms. Norma, will you give us your contact information, your phone number? Do you have that? Um, I don't remember my store number. <laughs> it is on the uh, Facebook page, Southern Collective, and we're open Saturday from 10 to 5 and Sunday from 1 to 5. We do a live uh, Facebook live show every Sunday at 4 p.m. And that way we show you products. All you have to do is comment, give me your email address. We'll invoice you and you just come pick up at your convenience. So that does really well. It's a great way to kind of put your product out there to show people what you have and they can shop from home. So we do really well with that. It's a lot of fun. Um, so we're here um, right now, only open on the weekends until you know God makes a way for um, somebody to help me work during the week. But as of right now, it's just the weekends, but we do really well. Uh, just being here on the weekends is, of course, is your busiest time for shopping. Right, right. Okay, so um, also, if you'd like to be a member of the Florence Chamber, Jordan, would you like to tell us how to do that? Yes, yeah. yeah, so um, with the Florence Chamber of Commerce, we are really just looking to highlight businesses like Norma's. Um, 
to help promote them you could if you already have a brick and mortar store or if you're just online or if you are just a service like Kathy here is a real estate agent um, any type any type of business that you own is welcome um, but you can contact us on Facebook it is the Florence Chamber of Commerce or my cell phone number is 601-941-0606 um, feel free to text or call me we would love to have you uh, join us all right thank you ladies for your time this morning um, we want to wish everyone a happy Thanksgiving yes. uh, that is coming up so come on out get your shopping done and um, shop local and help our small businesses continue to grow because it is our small businesses that uh, help the community. We do lots of fundraisers, we help our community grow, and um, so shop local. And I do have one more thing to say. With our community growing, we are starting to do businesses of the month. Um, last month we did nominate Oh My um, Gifts and Things Downtown for our, the October Business of the Month. We did not vote on that one, we just nominated her because she's done a lot to help us um, get started but this was the first month that we actually voted on it as a public and I am happy to say that Miss Norma won. Oh, yay. She received a, a little over 60% of the votes so it, um, she will be our November business of the month. Yay. All right. Thank you ladies. Thank y'all so much.